Hey kids, welcome to Monster Mondays, the return of Monster Mondays. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to be consistently doing this every week, but I'm doing it today. I uh, rediscovered, thankfully on YouTube, uh, an old TV movie from 1979 called Vampire. Uh, this was originally supposed to be a TV show. Uh, I can't remember if they decided before they aired the show or the movie, uh, or the movie didn't do well enough to uh, warrant a, a TV show. Uh, the movie uh, stars uh, Richard Lynch. as Anton Voltek, essentially a, a Dracula stand-in. Uh, he's very Dracula-like. Uh, uh, Jason Miller and E.G. Marshall uh, are also in the, the, in the cast. Uh, the setup is uh, a new church is being uh, uh, constructed on land that uh, this Volche Voltec uh, vampire <laughs> made his home, and in fact he's still there. Uh, the first indication is they construct for whatever reason they construct a uh, cross before they construct the building uh, and the ground uh, due to the cross and the sunlight because uh, the shadow falls upon the ground and it it burns the ground up E.G. Marshall who's a retired uh, police officer notices this uh, little backstory. uh E.G. Marshall's uh, uh, partner back in the 30s disappeared because uh, he, he was on the trail of uh, uh, Anton, the vampire. Uh, but uh, that's jumping ahead a bit. But, uh, uh, well, by the time that the uh, sun sets, uh, the vampire... It can't take it, take it anymore, having a damn cross, you know, stuck in his ground and right there for him to uh, see when he emerges. And it's like, he's not, he's not happy. <laughs> but, uh, well, eventually, uh, Voltec, uh, comes across uh, John Rollins and his wife Leslie Rollins played respectively by Jason Miller and the absolutely drop-dead gorgeous uh, uh, Catherine Harold Well, cut to the chase. Voltec, you know, gets a bit of a hard on for uh, Leslie, and uh, she just uh, was, he he does his fiendish uh, act on her. <laughs> so, and Jason Miller goes into full uh, brooding mo mode for uh, <laughs> the rest of the running time. Uh, until he meets uh, E.G. Marshall. Uh, he's still brooding, but they uh, they do partner up to uh, defeat the vampire. That's pretty much it. Uh, and that's the setup for, for the TV show. There is a damsel in, uh, uh, in distress. Let's see if we find her name. She used to be on a TV show. 
uh, Barry Youngfellow. Uh, Cute uh, redhead. I had completely forgot about her, and I did watch her TV show. I forgot the name of it, but uh, and it ran for years longer than I thought. But uh, uh, but it, it, it's it sets up that she's the damsel in distress, and they have to save her, and it's it's like a, an extended episode. Uh, but at the same time, it really is well uh, put together, well directed. There's really some nice camera work in this, especially for a TV movie. Uh, if they would have been able to keep that uh, uh, that level of uh, you know cinematic uh, visual style, it 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 would have been pretty damn good TV show. Uh, yeah, Jessica Walters also in it. kind of volt tech uses her to get to uh get to uh jason miller and katherine harold or at least they uh that's how they meet up uh well this 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 is actually a very good uh, uh you know tv movie uh it'll disappoint you by the end that you know it's it's sort of obvious that this was set up to be a tv show you know in short Voltec does get away, <laughs> and uh, oh, that would have been great to have uh, Jason Miller and E.G. Marshall in a TV show, even if it just was one season. Uh, you know, just like uh, you know, Kolchak, the Night Stalker TV show. Uh, well, it, that's it for uh, you know this installment in Monster Mondays. Just a uh, nice little review of a uh, probably mostly forgotten uh, vampire uh, TV show or proposed TV show uh, you know Richard Lynch he, you know he was great you know I think he would have deserved deserved this you know a nice paycheck that a TV show uh, would have uh, afforded him Uh, well, uh, thanks again for, uh, uh, the concept from, uh, Q's reviews. He's, uh, he started up his Monster Mondays again after, you know, a long time. Uh, mine is pretty long, too. I stopped Monster Mondays when I did the, uh, 31 Days of Horror for Halloween. And, uh, well, I'm back. <laughs> uh, might be in Frank with, though. Uh, well... Until next time, uh, as usual, stay safe. I was have a good time. Okay, bye now.